My name is uh, Robert Eminger. I go by Rob. Uh, I'm a retired Marine. I served almost 29 years in the Marine Corps. In the military, I worked in the ammunition field. Um, I started as an enlisted Marine and uh, became an officer later. When my first combat tour was uh, Desert Shield, Desert Storm. My second one was uh, Somalia. Third one, Iraq. Fourth one, Iraq. And then the fifth one, Afghanistan. So uh, in Afghanistan, when we were there, um, if we lost a service member, they would have kind of a ramp ceremony where that is the first point where the remains come home. Early on in, the, in the, my year there, I, I found out about them and, and uh, you're on a flight line in the middle of the night saluting flag draped remains. We only had the the body bags with the with the flag and you can see the contours and everything and I remember saluting standing there saluting and all I could think of were the, the families at home I noticed it more later in my career and and not being able to not being able to focus uh, not being able to stay on point not uh, searching for words um, not being able to uh, really comprehend when I was reading things. In 2016, I had to stop working. I went to school for photography, and that led me to uh, starting to photograph all the Defenders of Freedom events. Donna uh, asked me, she actually texted me one night and, and asked me if I would consider uh, doing the brain treatment. And so I came in and, and did the evaluation and came in thinking I was jokingly perfect and that turned into a very humbling uh, result. It basically showed what I already knew but was hiding and and so I agreed obviously to the, to the treatment and, and uh, very thankful that I did. For the next two weeks um, went through my treatment and I say it was my treatment because that's exactly what it was. The doctors looking at me and my situation and my experience and what was actually affecting me, not, not applying a template uh, that's just being applied to everybody else. It was, it was looking at not only um, physically what was going on with me, but what I was presenting day, every day and, and how they needed to go about applying the different therapies to, to help me. During the first week, through one of the evaluations, uh, it was determined I was reading at a 30% at a comprehension rate. Um, by the next week, I was reading at a 100% comprehension rate. I experienced the, the first day um, something that, I, that actually brought me to tears because first day, I, for the first time that I could remember, uh, I didn't have pain in my feet. And I literally sat in a chair crying because I could not believe I did, my feet didn't hurt. Uh, my purpose now, I believe, is, is definitely giving back to our veteran community. I'd like to thank the doctors uh, for what they do, the incredible work that they do. Um, I've said many times that, that they are the right people doing the right thing in this world. Again, it's, it's, uh, the work they do is, is changing lives, it truly is.